Good morning. So, I'm getting some batteries uh, for this camera. Uh, this is Thursday, June 6th, I believe. Yeah, a lot of things happen. So, the video card should get to uh, the individual. Um, I'm actually getting four new batteries and a battery charger that has, uh, I can put two at a time. So I got the original one I came in, so I can do three batteries. Um, next week, around Tuesday and Wednesday, I should be getting some more, um, um, uh, the dummy battery and a couple more lenses. I get the batteries today. Tomorrow I'll get a lens and then Saturday I'll get a lens. And then Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday I'll get everything for this little bitty camera right here. So this is at uh, what I consider 18 millimeter equivalent. You got to put the uh, metal thing or the bracket because I'm looking at the LCD screen to all the way to there. So the screen would be flipped up over, all right? But then what I do to keep the camera from cooling is I just tilt the screen just back a little bit. And that way it's kind of pointing up. And um, anyway, uh, that's just for heat issues. It's a quick uh, video. I'm having my coffee. Uh, I'm getting two lenses today from my local camera store. Somehow, they never picked up the mail. They, they created the label, but they forgot to pick it up yesterday or the day before. They, oh, it's going to take two days. I got notified, and then they changed it. No, they're going to deliver it today. So they said that yesterday also. And I, you know, they said it'd take two days, even from Austin. No problem. I got plenty of lenses, plenty of stuff to do. So I already watered the plants in the back. I got to water the front, do a little vlogging, do a lot of pictures with this. And uh, I can't go anywhere because people are going to be dropping off stuff. So I think FedEx, UPS, I don't know if they, you know, they did mail some of the stuff through the post office, so, you know, that's eBay. So, uh, that's what I'm expecting, too. So, anyway, uh, we'll get back to you later. Let's take some pictures. Okay, even with this wide field of view, 18, 35 millimeter, whatever, let me go to the first one. As you can see, and let me, it's always the first one, it's the smallest. Yeah. So what I'm gonna do, because preview is always different, so I'm just gonna go like that. And you know what, this might have been at three by two, this picture right here. The other ones I think I put on 16.9, whatever. Uh, I can do in JPEG and RAW files, okay? And it's looking good, as you can see. Um, if I go back here to look at my information, this is at 35 millimeter, okay? And the f-stop was 16. see but you know the pictures are good if I do like uh, if I bring it in just to show you how sharp it is okay this is a one inch sensor I don't know where I was focusing on so I'm gonna go dip back down but you know I don't see any uh, noise or anything on here uh, I it just it looks everything looks balkanized <laughs> but it looks good and I'll go back to zero you 
Yeah, and, and you can see the sides where I wasn't straight on. Okay. So you see a little distortion, but still, that's a good picture. Okay. Now let me go back to the second one. Okay. So this might be in a three by two format, um, just to show you around. Now here are some sharp pictures. And I am going to be comparing this camera with the RX100 Mark V. It's a built-in lens, 24 to 70, uh, full frame equivalent. But still, all right. Now, the wind was blowing. So if you, you'll see some parts are clear, some that are out of focus. I try to focus the little buds right there and the branches moving and you can see where the other parts are in focus. Same thing in here, okay? Some of the flowers are in focus, some aren't because the wind is blowing the uh, leaves. But it's beautiful pictures and these are raw files, folks. So it can do raw files. Wonderful pictures. Um, I'm trying to look at the file size right here. So this is at uh, 35 millimeters still, at 5.6. Um, 3712 by 5, 55.68. Okay, that's on the monitor. Okay, raw. And it's type 24, shooting mode 32, shutter count 1,206, uh, focus mode AFA, flash setting normal, but I didn't use a flash. White balance is on auto. And um, yeah, I'm looking at the other stuff. Okay, so the compression is uh 34713 that's how big the file is okay so it, it's not too bad and uh i'll keep going down sorry i, I just get uh, a little sidetracked because i'm kind of inter interested also so you'll see when i change from 35 millimeters to uh, 18 Everything gets smaller. Still at 35 millimeters. Now, yeah, it's still there. Okay, what's going on? I'm pretty sure I put it at 18 millimeters. It might have been the first shots. My memory's going, folks. Sorry about that. Oh, there it is. Okay. 35 millimeters, 18 millimeters. Not, not a huge difference, same position. That was a better shot. So these are all at uh, 18 millimeters. Now it's at 35. So uh, these are good shots, like for vacation and stuff. You'll see a little lens distortion, um, but it's not too bad. I got the uh, wider screen or the wider focal length, uh, 18 to 35. I'm getting some primes. I'm getting the uh, 50, 35, uh, ones of 1 1.2, and I think that's the 35. The 50 is a 1.8. Um, I'm also getting a telephoto, which is a 500 with the uh, 2X magnifier, which will make it a thousand. So I'm going to surprise you. I'm going to get some nice bird and wildlife sh shooting with this small camera. Okay. And the last thing I'm going to get is my dummy battery. 
So at least I'll have four batteries to last me maybe. Eh, I say one battery can last me about. If I do no videos, about an hour on shooting. I, I don't know. I, I keep putting videos in here. And uh, it uh, and I didn't know I had it on 4K15. So. And as you can see, these are beautiful pictures. I love in my tree. This is back in 18 millimeters. 35, 18 millimeters. Excellent pictures. Look at that. Just gorgeous. And I'm going to increase it a little bit. There you go. Here's an ending shot. I'm going to make it full screen. What do you think? Good enough? All right. So thank you for watching. Remember, stay safe, keep smiling, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye, folks. Have a wonderful day.